Good morning, good afternoon, hello, hi, it's Justine, and this is my channel. If you guys are new here, welcome. I've had quite an influx of subscribers lately, and it's been super fun. So to anyone who has, you know, joined my channel from that, welcome. I'm excited that you're here. I make videos on YouTube, and I've been doing it for about 11 years, and sometimes when I think about that, it is insane. <laughs> like, it's actually really crazy. I have a dog. His name's Maddie. I have an addiction to amiibo. I like video games, I like food, I like candy, I like eating pizza a lot. I'm not a very good cook, but yet I do try. I really like succulents. I like Star Wars, although I never saw Star Wars as a kid, so I like Star Wars as an adult, having seen the Star Wars movies and watching them in the completely wrong order. Anyway, my point of this video is I am also a vlogger, and sometimes when I think about vlogging and how long I've been vlogging and how much incredible content that I have to go back and to watch is really, really fun, but recently I've been having this feeling of I don't want to. I don't want to vlog. Like it's it's this weird feeling where I don't want to film something. I don't want to have a camera in my face. I don't want to have a camera in my friends' faces. Which is why my vlogs have been sort of non-existent, really. But today I'm gonna be posting a really long vlog because these are all of the vlogs that I've. How many times am I gonna say vlog? I've been filming videos, but I just haven't been posting them. So I thought all of those videos and vlogs that I have filmed that are probably so old at this point, I'm just gonna post it all in one video. And that's this video. But today, we're gonna start out with what I do today. <laughs> Some of these clips that you guys are gonna see, it's from like a month ago. And I was asking myself, am I a bad vlogger? And I think you get burned out making videos every single day about your life, about the most mundane things. And I have so many props to people who can do this every single day because I just can't. Because at some point, I actually was living my life in post-production. I still edit almost all of my own videos, so I will go and do something super fun and super cool, and then I'm not really enjoying it in the moment. I enjoy that moment later when I'm actually editing and making whatever it was that I did into a fun story. A fun story that I get to tell you guys, a fun story of how I want to remember whatever it was that I was doing. <laughs> and I'm so grateful that that is something that I get to do, but after doing it for so long, it does start to sort of affect how you do things, I guess on a daily basis because you wake up and you say, I don't have a video for today. What can I go do that will be cool to make a video about? And you don't wake up and say, wow, I'm gonna go have a great day and enjoy it and spend it and live it. I'm gonna film it and record it. I'm not complaining, I'm just saying it's a different way that I think a lot of people who make videos every single day kind of take on their day, if that makes any sense. So I guess what I've been trying to do is have more pre-edited content and having things where I don't feel so stressed out that if I wake up and I don't have a video, it's gonna be okay. I try to post videos every day, but lately it hasn't been every day. I'd rather post better videos for you than have something that's sort of forced content. Like if I don't have something good, I mean, and to be honest with you, a lot of that reason is because I, I can't vlog myself sitting right here, playing Zelda all day unless I'm a streamer and I'm not. I will tell you, my house is such a mess, like it needs cleaned. Here's a picture of Maddie that my sister got me for my birthday. That's, you'll see that pretty soon when I unbox that, cause clearly I haven't posted that video yet either. But right now the dog is going to go to the groomers, which I'm pretty sure I have a clip of me doing that several weeks ago. Hello my little pig. Anyway, I gotta go because he's gotta go get his hair cut. Got my bag all packed. Shout out to my friend Amy. I met her on the internet and this is her book. It's called Log Like a Boss. She is so awesome. I'm gonna put a link in the description if you guys wanna get this. There's also a little quote from me and also some other YouTubers too on the back. So be sure to check that out. She's awesome and just a super incredible kind girl and she makes really fun videos. So go check her out. I gotta go, I gotta go. I'm see this is, this is the thing with the vlogging is nothing is ever just Okay, let's go. It's okay, let's go. Now we gotta film it, and then I gotta get a different angle, and then is the lighting okay? I wonder how long this vlog is gonna be. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh, look at her. You handsome little man, look at you. Ooh. Look at you, look at you. What's up here? There's something here. <laughs> 
here getting my hair done today. I think we're gonna try to do it a little bit darker, but not like too dark. So we'll see what happens, but here we go. something really stupid today. I was editing and I basically deleted half of the video that I was editing and it's a super long video. It's probably about almost 25-30 minutes. It was the video that I posted yesterday with the Zelda gameplay in it and sometimes if there's a bottom clip that's attached to a top clip that you're trying to delete, the clip that's attached to the clip that you're trying to delete sometimes will just select everything and then it deletes all of it and I didn't realize it until I was done editing the entire video so I had to export the end part of the video, go back I can find an old saved library from yesterday where I edited the first half and then once I had that I then took the end bottom piece and then pieced it back together for the beginning part but then had to fill in the blanks in the beginning and oh my goodness it's just it's <laughs> Thankfully it all worked out and it only cost me maybe an extra hour or so of editing but I definitely did not account for that so here's the new hair which I didn't show you guys can you tell that it's different this is much darker and this is a little lighter so now it all kind of matches. There was just a lot of stuff going on. Getting gas right now. I got a Starbucks. I've got a cold. I've got a hot. I've been having a problem lately because I've been drinking both of them. I can never usually decide if I want a hot or a cold drink, so I end up, instead of getting a venti of one, I just get a tall of two. And it works out great. It's been a really, really great system. And I just got my birthday reward today, so hallelujah! I didn't use it though because I'm using that on a venti for sure. My car was basically completely empty. 20 gallons, it's still going. I don't even know how I got here. Oh my, oh, it's still going. Okay, maybe I have a bigger tank than I thought. All right, let's go. I am off to shoot today a fun little video with Sarah Dietschy. She is an awesome YouTuber and she's in LA right now and was like, hey, you want to shoot a video? And I said, yeah, I do. I'm gonna set my GoPro up for some driving shots because why not? I apologize in advance for 15 different frame rates in this video. Alright guys, this is a sight to see. You know, it's not bad enough that I'm like carrying one coffee, like I'm carrying two and they're both for me. This is ridiculous. So guys, I finally made it. I was just telling Sarah too about my uh, the struggle of deleting my entire video. <laughs> it's something that always happens. No yeah. matter how long you make videos, you just make those mistakes. Well, yeah, and I feel like we're always in a hurry because, exactly. you know, we put out a lot of content. You post a lot too. It's fun. Monday through Friday. Yeah. It keeps me on my toes. It's never perfect though. You know, I you always have to deal with the guilt of not posting a video. Missing. I know. And it like tears you apart, but it's like the world does go on. Yeah, I mean, I post every day. We, you guys know what that means. It's like I say that, but like every day there's gonna be something but somewhere. You, you're so good with like variety. You well, thank you. Crush it. Thank it's you. like you're a tech ninja, but also cooking, well, and just lifestyle, yeah. and it's amazing. That's great. Well, this vlog is like a month long. So the rest of this video is basically what I've been doing for the past month. So it's great. But we just filmed some really fun videos. They'll be out like next week ish. You guys will know. But this is Sarah. Oh, wait, here's the better lighting. This oh, way. yes, yes. So this yes. is Sarah. Hey guys. Go to check out our channel and prepare yourself for it's our. Fun. Apple Watch yeah. video. Yes, Apple Watch, we both rock the ceramic. And I just want to say thank you for including me in this. No. You're just, you're amazing. Oh, well, thank you. Like, I know your peeps know this, but you, she is amazing. Oh, thank you. So I, you know, I would watch you like four or five years ago. This, oh my goodness. This kid in high school thinking maybe I could make internet videos one day. And here you are. And here, so it's huge. You're crushing it's a, it. It's a big deal. Cause oh, you're a huge you. inspiration to me. You are. And she's, she likes drones and I have not gotten to the booster board, but when I do, I'm calling you. Yes, hands down. <laughs> we'll boost around New York City. I can't do that. I believe in you, Jessica. I don't. I don't think you so. You can do it. I believe. In you. Well, thank you so much for having me in your video. Yes, yes thank yes. you. Thank you. Okay, so I'll <laughs> figure out which coffee I'm gonna drink next. <laughs> this is so amazing. It's this right here. Please, did you explain to them what you? Yeah, what you did? I couldn't decide. Yeah. You know, so here we are. Mad props. So today we're at the YouTube space and we're doing something super cool. Right now we're going to be hopping into VR. There's going to be people joining us VR, but the people that are joining us are not just any people. They are the Power Rangers. So here's what it actually looks like right up here. So 
all those people actually have headsets on, so they are in our virtual reality environment. It's kind of hard to explain, but I will show you guys a quick clip right here of what we're actually doing. Hey everyone, I am Just Eze Eric, and I am so excited to welcome everyone to the Power Rangers Virtual Reality Experience. So, we are joined here by the stars of the new Power Rangers film, so say hello everybody. Hey. Hi! What's up guys? We have got our Red Ranger, Dacre Montgomery. Hello! We've got our Black Ranger, Ludi Lin. What's up dudes? Pink I do that. Ranger, Naomi Scott. Hi! Our hey. blue ranger over here, RJ Kyler. Hello. And our yellow ranger, Becky G. Hey. Okay, I gotta hop into VR now. We're doing a live VR panel, so I'm interviewing the Power Rangers as myself, but an avatar of myself. So it's like I'm, I'm a body of, of pixels. finish up doing the VR experience, it was nuts because towards the end everybody started increasing their avatars and I was actually getting stepped on in VR life. It was so crazy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Do you want me to take her off a leash? Yes. Sure. Anybody. Maddie, it's your girlfriend. So this vlog just turned from Power Rangers to now we're watching The Bachelor or Bachelorette. I have no idea. I've never watched the show, but apparently this is the finale. Someone's either going to get married or get booted. That's what I, that's but what is I this the finale? Is this the... this is the finale. Oh. Final rows and everything. So I'm, I'm assuming that these are the last girls that are... These two, they look exactly the same. When I walked in earlier, I came over here and I was like, oh, look at this cute picture of Ro and Molly. And I was like, that's not Ro and Molly. Who are these strangers in their house? <laughs> Guys, look who's here. Francesca. Long lost. I haven't seen you. It's been so long. When have I seen you last? Oh, wow. What? Yeah, that's fun. And then you went gallivanting off to the islands. You got really sick. But yeah, I'm going to hike this week. That'd be nice. Yeah, I need to get outside. Like, I've just been playing Nintendo and it's it's bad news. I heard it's really good. Oh my god. It's like 11 out of 10. Oh, so fun. Ew, Ava. And here's Ava. Ava, come say hi. Hi, sweetie. You look beautiful. She's like, I'm beautiful. I'm pretty. I'm yes, you crazy. are. You like cucumber. Oh my. And there's Jenna. Hi. Did I already say hi to you in my vlog? No, but I was peeking in the back one. I was like, so I haven't watched. Is it, wait, is it The Bachelor or The Bachelorette that we're watching? Okay, so that's the guy is picking the girls. Yeah, and who's born? Yeah. yeah. I haven't seen any. Never seen one single episode of any. I don't think she's gonna pick anybody. I haven't either. Um, they once came up to me and asked if I was interested in being on the show. And then when I told her, no, no, no. She goes, well, how old are you? And I told her, and she's like, oh, well, you can still come in. You can still come in for the meeting anyway. Maybe like, maybe you could be like in your tan, then you're you're eligible. I was like, uh, oh, I'm good, thank you. Maybe you can go for like the grandma. Oh. By LA standards. You know what? Mm. We're young and vibrant. Okay. Look at me, I'm out past 7:30. That's true. Okay, where's my dog? Oh, yeah, I, don't know. I promise you that I would not be. Guys, look at all the dogs. This is incredible. Henry and Cookie, and this is Lou. Yeah. Ava's over there. Where's our baby at? I don't know. Where's Maddie? So we're watching the show now. I can't believe this is a real show.
show and people watch it. This is unbelievable. What do you think of the show, Ro? What do you think? Well, I think I called it. I had a good feeling. We have been playing the Fantasy League of Bachelors. Oh my god. I thought Chris was going to win, so I was a little off, but Vanessa was a close second, and I think that's going to happen. Just, my favorite part of this, Justine, is he goes, I'm going to miss you, and she goes, I know. She said that? <laughs> That's good. Ro was passing out gifts, so you had to guess who you thought was going to win. Did you get one? Oh, I got it. I am the love doctor, they call me. Oh, I see. I see. These are even like, these are branded. Branded oh candies God. or something. <laughs> oh, it's from Sugarfina. It's real good. This is like primo candy. That is good. It's, uh... Wow. Th oh, roses. Go figure. Go figure. I also guessed correctly, but I also cheated. So I said that I cheated, so I'm not sure if I'm going to actually get the candy or not. Did you write on the thing? I did. Yeah, I did. At least you're honest about it. I also guessed this girl, uh, just judging by purely off of like what you know. me, shallow, completely shallow, just based off what Wow, wow, this show, I can't, I don't even want to talk about it, I'm done, we're done. I hope I get the candy though. I cheated. Yes. We'll still give you, we'll still give you, thank you. That's okay. You were honest. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve it. Hello! It's been a really long time since I've vlogged. If you guys are following me on Twitter, Instagram, or anywhere else, then you know I've been incredibly sick for the past week. Most of you seem to think it's because of my cooking, and I really probably wouldn't disagree with you. So for the past week, I've been pretty much sitting right here on this couch, playing Zelda, and being extremely deathly ill. And when I wasn't playing Zelda, I was in bed sleeping, or taking the dog for a walk. You might also be wondering, Justine, why are there six laundry baskets here? Well, there was only supposed to be one laundry basket, but for some reason, I guess I didn't read the description on Amazon and it was actually six laundry baskets. So now I have an abundance of laundry baskets. I'm gonna pack up my Switch and I'm gonna go visit Jenna because Maddie is gonna go to the DP. That's short for dog park. I can't say it out loud because he gets too excited. For those of you who sent me get well soon wishes, thank you. I'm finally starting to feel better. It was pretty much the worst week ever. The Nintendo Switch doesn't have any carrying cases out yet. No, that's not true, they're out. I just can't get them, they're all sold out. So I'm using this little toiletry bag. So we're just gonna put this in like so, controls. And that's really all I need. Time to go visit Jenna. Oh, I forgot, I need my Amiibo trading cards so that I could import some goodies. Nintendo Switch in. We are on our way to see my sister. I can't say her name because the dog knows it. <laughs> Maddie, are you excited? Maddie's been cooped up for the past week and he is beyond excited to be at the dog park right now. He made a new little girlfriend. Like, look at this picture. It is so cute. They're holding paws. <gasps> My heart. Is anybody thirsty? Do you guys want to get a drink? Ooh, what's here? Some presents for Jenna. Did you have fun at the dog park, Maddie? You made a girlfriend. Hey, can I borrow your microphone, please? Yeah, I was just about to use it. Oh. So mine took quite the tumble. This whole plastic part broke, which the microphone is probably fine, but I need to get another mount. So that happened. Jen, are we gonna unbox it now? Yeah, we are, girl. We're about to unbox Jenna's Nintendo Switch. This is big news. Big news. Very big news. I also brought you another present that I'll let you unbox. Wow. Do I already know what it is? Yes. <laughs> cool. Yeah. What did you get me? What's in here? What's... Oh! <gasps> Maddie! It's you, baby! Look! It's the... Oh my goodness! Is that you? Is that the dog? Guys, look! It's Maddie! It's the, like, hey, the, the pop your pup thing, so it's like the pop art. <gasps> it's so cute! Thank you! Oh, and that's our baby! Oh my goodness! Daddy, where are we gonna put this? 
This is so cute. They had all kinds of different backgrounds, but the blue looked good. They had like pizza and like poop. Oh, it looks so good on you, man. Oh, I'll touch you on the thing. Jen, there's your switch. It's been unboxed. Yay! What do you think? I'm excited. I have to charge it and set it up and um figure out how to play Zelda and read this whole book. I've got a lot of work to do. So I've never been one to buy game guides for anything and for Zelda I did because there are so many little small tiny things that when I got the game, there was absolutely nothing online when I got the game. So this was kind of like my only source of, hey, I'm stuck in a shrine, I'm desperate, I don't know what to do. For the most part, I've been able to figure out everything, but it is so nice to be able to have something to reference because let me tell you what, this game's hard. Well, now I'm just gonna reference you because I don't, I already, you already. Well, I had nobody to talk to. I was talking to like Maven and we're just like chatting and. <laughs> yeah. He loves Zelda. It's so fun. Well, I guess now that you're doing that, I can go play my game. Is it like a step by step? There is, but don't do the walkthrough. I mean, I only reference it when I'm like, okay, I am confused and I need help. But now there's actually stuff online so you can find information, whereas before there was nothing and I was That's good. stuck. Uh, yeah, office is still in the kitchen. And if you're wondering why, the roof in my office was leaking. So I had people come in to fix said leak, but now I'm resorted with working here. So I figured the rest of this vlog is gonna be from some clips from the past couple of weeks that I never even posted. I mean, I went to Disney, didn't even post the vlog. I was hanging out with Ro, and I had just got back from vacation. So put yourself in the mindset of a few weeks ago. Today is Maddie's day. We're off to get a little haircut because he definitely needs a trim. It's been raining so much in Los Angeles for the past week and a half or so that this dog has gotten disgusting. Just like my house. <laughs> my sister Jenna, as you guys, you've seen her in my videos. Yes, actual sister, not like fraternity sister or just calling her my sister for the sake of calling her my sister. Actual, real life sister. Jenna was watching Maddie. She was watching him while I was on vacation. I actually went on a real vacation. I didn't edit for almost six days straight. I haven't done that probably in 11 years, which is insane. I didn't film anything. That's not true, I actually made it maybe two days without vlogging and I, I missed it, so I did vlog a little bit. But it wasn't like I had to do it because I had prepped ahead of time almost a week of videos so that I could actually take a legit time off from the internet and it was Incredible, it was great. A real vacation, who would have thought? That's a thing. Uh, this chapstick is cake batter. So now that I'm back, I've got my laptop, so I'm gonna edit while Maddie gets a haircut, and I've actually missed editing. I might be one of the few YouTubers that actually enjoys editing, but I'll tell you what, it was quite nice not having to worry every single day about, oh, what video am I gonna post? Maddie had a fun time at camp with Jenna. We're going this way, come on. Boost up, boost up. There you are. I miss this little dog so much. And trust me, I'm Ed Sheeran is perfect. And the man on the a perfect human being. Start to dance and I'm singing like, girl, you know I want your love. Your love was handmade for somebody like you. I'm in love with your body, Maddie. Time to get his little hair cut. He's gonna look so cute. This day is all about Maddie. Whatever he wants to do. Well, that's not true, because if it was his choice, he would not be getting a haircut. That's not something that he would want. I think he has to poo. Tail is down so far because he knows where we're at. He knows it's time for the haircut. Look at that tail, down so far. That is not how my little dog usually is. Let's go, let's go. There we go. Hi, here for Maddie. Maddie's still getting his hair cut, so I thought I would just sit in my car because I was at a cafe earlier and it was really cold out, so I decided, hey, let's go in the car and edit some videos. That's what we're doing. It's working out nicely. There we go. Some extra leg room. Laptop room. <gasps> and I'm getting Wi-Fi from the cafe next door. This is perfect. Heated seat, Wi-Fi, everything's going perfect. All trimmed up, looking good. You feeling good, bud? Ah! 
So yesterday, Maddie had such a nice little day, but now I'm also having a nice day with Ro. I can't, like, I've seen Hello. you so many times this week. Like, it's great. I know. This is, like, making me really happy. I know. We just got back from Hawaii. Mm -hmm. um, we did, like, a crazy kayak hike mm -hmm. thing. It to a so waterfall. Fun. It was beautiful. And then, um, oh, we just played, we played a few games. We and did. I made Justine do this really weird celebration high five gadget. Yeah, thing. um, this is what it was. I'm going to steal it from your Twitter. Okay, cool. So. And loaded. Okay, Justine, high five. Oh my gosh, it worked. That's what we just did. I don't exactly know where I got it. Someone really cool sent it to me when I went to go visit a friend, and I was like, I gotta try this out. It was pretty cool. Surprisingly, it worked. And then Ro showed me she has like this vacuum that comes out of the wall, yes. which you don't have to show it again. I'll just cut to the Snapchat. Okay. So. Here's my vacuum. I had to show you this. It's too cool. It's built into the wall. The central vac. Pull this red button, and it's live. Let's go clean up our mess. Okay. Good to go. Wow. We can just pick it up. Okay, so that's that happened. <laughs> it's a central vac. I've never had one of these. This is the first time I've ever had one. And it's amazing. It's changed my life. You can just vacuum the whole house. Oh, it's so great. And we just filmed, well, we're going to film another video of, let me show you guys. I've showed you this before. But we, I bought so many of these things. They're like these little food, mini food things. And they taste like rotten food. But we got this one. It's a soda maker. And this one, chicken nuggets. It looks so gross. I'm a little nervous. I'm scared, the chicken nuggets especially. Excited because I like trying new things. Nervous because I don't think it's meat, right? It just kind of looks like powder paste. I don't Maybe know. Maybe like mold in the shapes? I have Maybe it's more like a gummy? Absolutely no idea. We're gonna find out. And we also did a taste test challenge on Rose channel of pineapple treats. Mm -hmm. so that you'll see that. A bunch of pineapple mm -hmm. things when we were in Hawaii. It was so good. <laughs> okay. Okay. We're gonna start filming and I'll see you guys later. So I'm back home now and I'm prepped and ready to shoot probably like two cooking videos. One is actually for St. Patrick's Day, so it's probably not gonna be for a while. Mm -hmm. This kind of looks really gross. I would have started shooting a while ago, but I have uh, a bunch of stuff coming on Amazon Prime that I forgot. I have SD cards because I can't seem to find two SD cards for my cameras. I'm doing kind of a little bit smaller of a setup because usually I go all out and it's crazy, so I need to try to pare it down to make the cleanup a little bit easier. That's something that we're gonna be making. So there is something that I really, really, really want. I never thought that I'd be like super into like kitchen gadgets, but guess what? Surprise! There's this incredible matte black mixer. It's a KitchenAid. So I asked Jenna if she wanted this one and then I would get this black one. It looks so good. Like this, look, this is it. These KitchenAid mixers are incredible. I have abused this thing. You guys have seen some of the things that I've put it through. I've also seen a ton of people online talking about how great they are. Some people have had theirs for years and years, like 28, I think somebody said something about they had theirs for like 18 years and they were hoping that it breaks because they wanted to get a new one, but it basically works like new after 18 years. So there's no getting a new mixer. But man, this thing looks so good. I, I just, I, can't, I saw it online, I was like, oh, beautiful. It would look so good with my theme of white and black, everything. Although I do really like this pink because sometimes it sits in the corner and it's a nice pop of color. I wish I could be shooting right now, but I don't have SD cards. I forgot what else I wanted to say to you guys. If you have any video suggestions, feel free to leave them below. I've been trying so hard to prep videos in advance so that I don't lose my mind. Back in the day on YouTube, you didn't have to make videos every day. Where's my prime order? So the video that I'm shooting right now, this one, I need to shoot it edit it because it's going up tomorrow. I'm making Nintendo Switch donuts. I don't know how it's gonna work out, but I'm hoping it works out really well. I've messed things up in boxes before, so there was a possibility of messing this up. I mean, nothing is ever guaranteed. That's causing a little bit of a backup. Oh, God! Scoop that over there. This one's a little bit too full. Scoop you in here. Maybe it's because I'm not a baker. They just do this for fun. But here's the question, am I having fun right now? I'm not sure. Debatable. Wow, that's a really, that's a really good camera angle. Hi, good morning, good day. I'm 
going to pick up Janet and we're going to brunch. It's a really busy day. I've been sitting around my house waiting for the Nintendo Switch to arrive so I can do an unboxing. Clearly I'm not sitting around the house though. I was, and then I got super antsy and hungry and I gotta go pick up my dog from Jenna's house. I wish I could take him to more shoots, but it ends up being way more of a hassle trying to babysit a dog plus actually do my job of whatever it is that I'm doing. He's been on a few sets with me and he's been really good actually, but he loves to play and he loves hanging out with people. The good thing is he's very quiet, so he doesn't really make a lot of noise. See, I'm gonna drive, pick up Jenna, brunch, unbox the switch, and live my life. Jenna! Yesterday at Ron's house, and then before that it was Maddie's day, and then you ended up taking Maddie because I had a film yesterday. But I'm gonna re reclaim the dog! No! We're having a great time together. Has he been having fun? What's he been doing? Oh my gosh, we've been to the dog park more times than you can even count. He's been pooping on everything, he's been... Living? Living, yeah, I guess. We Growling go on, at children. We go on lots of walks. We go on at least five walks a day. That's sweet of you. Long ones. We usually go on like five short ones. Oh god, <laughs> these are long, my hips hurt. <laughs> I'll walk. So this place has homemade English muffins, I've been told. I just hope it's as good as it was last month. Look at that muffin! Wow, they're big. Wow, wow, wow. Just wait until you try it. Is this, is this a dog park for activity for Jenna or a dog? <laughs> Jenna Park, dog park. Jenna Park, dog park. It's like hot and cold and then yes and no. Whoa, look at that. I'm so proud of my little boy. He used to never play with balls. He's chasing and running, having a good time. Ooh, looks like my office is a little bit messy, but I'm about to set it up, clean it up, and get it ready for the Nintendo Switch. I don't usually game up here in my office, but no, that's not true, I game here. Sitting in a chair, Xbox, PlayStation connects to here. This is my PC, and then this is uh, an extra monitor. But since the Nintendo Switch came out, I like playing Nintendo games on a bigger screen, and I could play it downstairs in my living room, but if I wanna capture and record, then I have to bring my capture stuff downstairs. So I thought that I would just clean up a little bit, bring a TV that I have in my guest bedroom into here. I'll use that, set it up, clean up this mess, and this will be the gaming station. I also gotta flip this couch around. I was hoping Jenna would be here to help me, but she's not here, so I kinda have to figure out how to do it myself. But the question is, am I gonna be able to carry this TV? I think I can do it. I'm overzealous. Hi, Maddie. Do you wanna go upstairs and help mommy do some stuff? Oh my God, this is so heavy. This is so heavy. Why, are, why is this? Why is this not something that I'm filming? This is so stupid! Oh God, my my fingers! Ow! Is it hard if I do it this way? No. Ah! I hate being independent. Why can't I be a woman who likes to have everyone else do everything for her? It's great. Here we go. God, these socks are sexy. You guys are getting a real behind the scenes here. Behind the scenes look. Oh my God! Okay, 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 we got it, we got it, 
We got it! And this is too... It's, it's, this cabinet is too small. Hey guys, we're at Disney today. I'm so excited. Now we will commence into the park for a fun time. Commence into? Commence. commence into. That wasn't what I wanted to say and then it just came out. Uh, let's cut to a nice fun Disney montage. These let's are, com let's these commence are, to it. These are all going to be fake stage shots to make it look like we're having an excellent time. We are having a good time, but it's going to be even more fun. Are you I'm, ready? I'm okay. having a good time. Jenna. I was here last week so I knew everything that I want to do. This is, Again, this is a music montage. Okay, ready? Laugh like you're having fun. <laughs> Wait, you're making the montage... <laughs> Now, like it's a live montage. No, no, no. What's I, montage? Ready montage. Oh, I'm montaging. No laps today. Okay, well, March March 2nd is the premiere, and I will be there, and I'm super excited about it. So, technically, it's out this week. Oh my god, it's what? the Beauty and the Beast! Is that Gaston? No, it's... Uh, is Gaston over there? Actually, I think it is. Gaston! He's here! What? Oh no. Get in line. Get in line. Disney! Gaston might be like a teenager. Come over here. <laughs> I don't think I want to wait. Maybe, maybe we, maybe we keep going. Gaston is 13 years old. Gaston's 13. We gotta get a picture for. We need to find an older one. So Gaston was a little too busy doing a pose off. So I'll just try to find the next Gaston that happens to be preening around the park. It said in the description that Gaston may be preening and Maurice and Belle. If I see oh. Goodness gracious! I feel like every time we're here, we never actually see any characters. I see them all the time. You must not open your eyes, woman. Eyes you got closed. a churro too far in your face. <gasps> Royal reception. Yeah, cause what? Oh my god, I have to get. Are we here? <gasps> Look at all these cute little things. I need you to be excited. Try the gray stuff. It's delicious. Do they have gray stuff? They do. I'm gonna get it. This okay. is it. Look. Yeah, I was expecting it to be really oh, but look, there's little dishes over there. That's cool. The line is very long. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's hosted by Minute Maid. Hashtag sponsor, hashtag ad. Okay, well, that was definitely not as exciting as I thought it was going to be. I don't think I'm gonna get the bucket. <laughs> I don't need that. Add a cup? Alright, as you can, you'll There's a hidden Mickey! Oh, I just touched it. <laughs> That's so cool! Are you snapping already? Did you get the shot earlier? Yeah! I was losing my mind. So I was like so excited. I saw this bag with me coming in, and then Ed comes over and's like, look what I got. And I was like, Ed, that is gonna look so good on you. Thank you. And he bought it for me! This is so great! Oh, I'll work. I'll oh my god, I can't wait! It's so cute! I can fit so many items in here! I think my Nintendo Switch will fit in here. Well, Switch. Got yeah. Side too. Oh, I can put my Joy-Cons there! Oh my gosh, I'm I'm a Joy-Con right now. My front bag. 
Yeah. We just waited about 45 minutes for Space Mountain. Hold on, are you leaving the line right now? Yeah, because they said it was closed. Where do you want to go gonna then? Be the second time that I've come to Disney and not rode a ride. Same. This is going to be the second time you've come to Disney and not ride anything. Let's go wait in line for Space Mountain and then leave. Let's go soar. Let's just go get another latte, maybe? maybe. Uh, please, I need a latte. I want a pizza pour. I'll get pizza. Maybe. We are leaving. We didn't ride a ride at all. We ate. Second time, no rides. <laughs> we didn't even get a churro. 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 We did less than one. Churro. No, the last time that I got a churro. churro. It tasted like churro. a I can't see it. It was not good. Churro. The churro. What churro? I'm gonna churro. buy myself something. Churro. The churro. The last time. I can't say it. The churro. Wait, don't run it. Okay, Disney. Bye. Another sweet, sweet sign of cooking videos that have been complete. I've got a couple in the can, so thankfully I won't have to worry about if there's a day that I'm like, oh my god, I don't have a YouTube video to post for today. I'll have a cooking video ready to go for you. So. I'm gonna bring this vlog to an end. So I'm gonna go play Nintendo Switch now. I finally, finally have some free time now that I'm done shooting my videos and I'm almost all caught up with my editing that I can finally start playing Zelda. Yes, yes, slay, slay queen. <clears throat> cool, well, I'll see you later, bye. Shoot, now I have to edit this video. Okay. So I bought some extra suntan lotion and I told Jenna, I was like, make sure you don't forget the lotion. She's like, well, where is it? And I said, I put the lotion in the basket. But what basket? <laughs> I feel like Brienne. I don't understand. Maddie? But what basket? Okay, I don't understand. <laughs> I put the lotion in the basket. You've got us all confused. No, no, no. You're confused. I know. I guess you already know that. God places the lotion in the bathroom. Please. Please. Oh, my God. Please. Please. He places the lotion in the bathroom. He places the lotion. Okay. So where's the lotion in real life? Because <laughs> I'm gonna leave here and I'm gonna forget the lotion. I'm gonna look like I'm gonna go home and be like, it's not in the basket. Okay, but to be honest, like it's actually in a basket. You have issues.